Welcome back to Facebook Monetization. And in this video, we are going to just conclude with some final thoughts about our talk about uh, doing a recurring membership inside of Facebook and creating uh, a, a number of products and creating a different income stream for your business. Now, <clears throat> again, remember the real business, the real benefit of being able to use Facebook in this way is that people are already here. What you're doing is you're taking advantage of the traffic that's already there in getting people to opt into your list and then moving them into products on Facebook. What you are also taking advantage of is Facebook's gating features for your content. So in other words, when you set that membership to close, people are not going to be able to see that content. And that means then you're going to be able to have a, a robust delivery system for your content without having to use a membership software site. And what you want to do is to give people to join you outside of Facebook for the maximum number of marketing opportunities. So make sure that you're getting people onto your email marketing list, even if they're even if they've liked your page, even if they've decided to come part of your, part of your membership. You want to make sure they're also on that email list. And remember, now if you want to monetize more. Do live events in addition to your content. Give people the opportunity who are not in your community to experience what's going on in your community through a live event. Do live events for your community so that you're bringing in experts who have products to sell, who can actually help your members and give your members a different voice. But again, make sure to be their affiliate when you do that. Offer different products when you do your own live events inside of your membership. These are great ways for you to increase the amount of monetization that you are able to do. And of course, make sure you do some free content. We just talked about doing a webinar where you invite uh, people who are not in your community, but also do uh, more content. You know, give your give people who are not members the opportunity to see some of the content that's available to them, and then use that content as bait to invite them inside of your membership. Remember, the best the best thing that you can do for your membership is to replace those members that are leaving with members at the top of your funnel, as opposed to going to the bottom of the funnel to do things to try to keep people in the membership. Because again, that will cause you to do the wrong things and to cause you to make the wrong decisions about content about. The the membership and about how you treat your members you want to make sure that you're always feeding people into the top so that you make the right decisions for the right reasons and to over deliver on what you promise and then use those other opportunities to provide additional content in additional products as opposed to stuffing everything into your membership to keep people in okay so with that thanks and i will see you in another video and or another course